again, you're coming at ye. I've got to explain something to you, by the way, right? Before we start this video. See how the videos I put on my channel the past few days and all that, right? Well, the guy that put these videos on YouTube were from my mate's channel. And so technically I'm not stealing anything. Right? And I'm not a plagiarist because I put all the credits under that video. Alright? So everybody's cool. I've made space alien videos before and they've had strikes on them. Every one of them because of copyright issues and the music wasn't even copyrighted. I've made videos about the Viking before and the Masons. And these things have been copyrighted and took off my channel again. I've had to put them in other channels. So this time, use the old noggin. Stevie. Stevie's putting other people's work on his, his channel now. You know what I mean? Wisdom. By the way, if you're not subscribed, subscribe. This is what I really want to do in the next video. I want to do a video about Pulsar and Quasar star systems. Get a bit dizzy after that. I want to do the next video, I want to do it on that by the way, because I've got deep, deep understanding about all that stuff. But that's not the real information me and Mr. Tootie want to give to you today. Where have you been this morning? Anyhow. We want to give you this very, very important information that we're about to give you right now. Now, apparently, the Queen hasn't been uh, around or hasn't been seen recently. Now, I've got a theory about that. I reckon that this Planet X, right, that's actually coming in the star system right now, that the Elite have actually made bases, right? These Masons again. I've actually made bases to escape Planet X, which leaves the rest of us exposed to this phenomena that was meant to cause extinctions on the after last time it appeared. And it's saying that it pure uh, extincted the dinosaurs, but me and Mr. Tootie know that there has actually dinosaurs still left on this Earth, isn't that right, pal? So I'll just read through this website. This is from the Daily Mail. It was actually written over a year ago, which shows you the urgency right now that we got to prepare right now for Planet X coming. Never mind Jesus coming to pray for Planet X. Now, it says yesterday, almost a year ago, more evidence for mysterious Planet 9. Planet 9 was revealed. Apparently it's written about in this novel here. Okay. Astrophysicists suggest this planet could have caused extinctions. As planet X orbits the sun, its tilted orbit slowly rotates and it passes through the Cooper belt. I remember David Cooper used to play for my favourite football team, the mighty well, who won the Scottish Cup. Never mind, that's another story. Belt of comets every 27 million years. When I was at school, the, Earth, the, the universe was 20 million years old. So now, uh, the orbit of this uh, Cooper Belt is every 27 million years. Quite. I mean, I've seen Back to the Future and it scrambles my brain, but sometimes, you know, reading a lot of these scientific journals just absolutely floors me. I have to lie down for about three days. This orbit causes comets to be knocked into the inner solar system. So if you can imagine a pool table, and the Earth is the black ball, it's about to be black ball, the Earth is the black ball, and then you hit the ball, and they all scatter around, everywhere, bounce off the cushions and all that, right? What's going to happen to the Earth in the next few years, or even the next few months, according to this article? Keep scrolling down, right? Got a picture of Planet X here, I don't know if you can see that. That was obviously taken by a astronaut. Or a robot, something. 
Uh, there we are, we ninth planet seems to be very big. Sometimes they got it as a red planet, in this case they got it as a blue planet. And in some cases it's actually a star system, it's a solar system with planets actually going round it as well. And here we see a Tyrannosaurus Rex. I have met a few of these characters the past few years, let me tell you, but spiritually that is. But I think that a lot of these dinosaurs are not extinct. I think they're still running around somewhere. And this is a picture of the solar system, which again taken by <coughs> Mr. Tooty, I think it was that time. So, what I want to expound to you today, other than going to watch my How to Survive the Tribulation video, which I made last week, I think that's an essential video to watch. But, what Mr. Tooty's been doing, He's been actually digging holes, and I understand why he's been doing it now, because he wants to prepare us to live through this Planet X thing that's going to come with loads of comets and hit the Earth, and it's going to cause a lot of tsunamis and all of that stuff, earthquakes and all, you name it stuff, right? Right? Which these masons are not telling you about, so we are preparing you, our viewer, free of charge, mind you. So, go and warn your neighbours, get your sack of rice from your local Pakistanis, make sure, make sure it's organic, none of your funny, genetically modified stuff, nonsense. Me and Mr. Toot, you always eat organic, straight from the ground, don't even wash it, right? And so, yes, my recommendation is you go out the back, dig a big hole, and hope that you're in time for this planet arriving, guys. See you in the next video, maybe. Subscribe.